Hello, welcome to Drive Institute. Today I'm going to show you how to build a super soil bed. Here in Drive, we focus on building the soil and this is one way of building our soil. The main aim here is we want to see that we have 10% organic material and we can be able to grow throughout and have soil which is much healthier. We are going to show you on how you can build your soil by making a super soil bed. This is a way of composting whereby we do it directly on our bed compared to building a compost pile whereby we do it somewhere else then we bring the compost and apply it on our bed. So welcome and let's move together. Here are the requirements. One, you need a djembe. Two, spade, a panga, a tape measure, green plant material, you need some logs or tree branches, also you need some pegs. The first step what you do is you measure your garden 5 by 20 feet which is the standard bed. The second step is you bisect your garden 5 feet by 5 feet. The third step is remove the topsoil, that is 30 centimeters deep, and then put it aside because later you'll put it back. Fourth step, put logs or big sticks if you have. We encourage mainly the base or the bottom, you start with the logs or big, uh, big sticks or tree branches. The other step after that is you put small sticks, add green plant materials you can have different green uh, green plant materials grass weeds leaves just add them after you have put the small sticks then after that if you have liquid gold and when we talk of liquid gold this is uh, human urine whereby you can collect and just add it after that and then sprinkle it over your your bed and then after you have done that uh, it is good that you put back the topsoil. As I said earlier, the topsoil that you started digging 30 centimeter deep, you have put it aside. Then this is the time to bring it back and cover your soil or your super soil bed. Then repeat the same procedure in the remaining three segments. This will happen, you can do it daily, weekly or monthly, depending on the availability of the material. Then after you have done that, let it settle for six months. But if you don't have a place that you can plant your crops, you can just plant shallow rooted crops because there is this decomposition process which is occurring, a lot of heat underneath. That's why we advise you to plant uh, shallow rooted plants. 